Look for changes to your commute on the west side as the Department of Public Works closes four ramps servicing a bridge on a major road. Our Elena Martella has all the info you need to know about these closures. Your commutes might get a little messy as DPW closes four ramps to access the Kessler Boulevard Bridge, so here's what you need to know to get around the closures. Those ramps in question are leading to the Kessler Bridge over 38th Street and I-65. And it's all part of a nearly $2 million project, completely rehabbing the concrete ramps on the west side of the bridge. There are signs to let you know how you can access Kessler Boulevard, 38th Street and I-65, but the main suggested detour routes include using 30th Street to enter and exit Kessler Boulevard to reach your destination. One driver we spoke with says she's not too happy. They should do partial lanes or something. I don't know. I don't deal with all that, but there's a way to go about doing it without shutting down those ramps because now people have to go way out of their way. We asked DPW why the full closure is needed and officials tell us, quote, it's safest and quickest to work under a complete closure. Trying to maintain safe conditions for workers while allowing traffic on half of the ramps would likely double the construction time period, end quote. This work is part of a $400 million infrastructure plan passed by the City County Council to rehab bridges, rebuild roads, and increase pedestrian and safety through 2022. Working for you, Elena Martella, RTV6. Thank you, Elena. And for complete detour, detour routes, as well as a map of the closures, you can search this story on our website at theindychannel.com or the RTV6 app.